for cheap PC games, Xbox Live codes, and more, then check out aniba.com and use code XRAYS for 3% off. Yo guys, what's up? It's x -Rays. Welcome back to another Apex Legends video. So today we actually got the official teaser for Season 1, which is called Wild Frontier, that's coming to Apex Legends tomorrow, which is actually kind of insane. They announced it the day before the Battle Pass was actually out, and shouldn't really be surprised, someone already pointed out, they revealed the game and then released the game on the same day, so not really that much of a shocker, but still kind of interesting. But anyways, uh, if you go over to their website, and I'll link it down below for you guys who want to check it out, but I will have it on screen here, so uh, it doesn't really matter. But this actually details what the Battle Pass has uh, and the, the different tiers you can buy for the, the level. So kind of like in Fortnite, you can buy either the basic one for 950 or you can buy a more kind of like extra 25 tiers or whatever for more money. Well, in this case, it gives us what it has. So Season 1, Battle Pass Wild Frontier, we have Jump In, Level Up, Unlock, Rewards. You can buy the basic one for 950 Apex coins, or you can buy the higher tiered one for 2,800 Apex coins. So the basic one gets you access to the basic one, so you can start unlocking from tier one, while the more advanced one actually gives you 25 levels instantly unlocked. Now, kind of disappointed, it's actually an extra 300 over the 25 tiers or levels. I would have been hoping it would have been 25, but whatever it is what it is, if you want to get to tier 25 or level 25 then this is the one you want to go with but if you don't want to spend money and you just want to go through it basic this is the one you want to go with so i'm probably going to get the basic one but it kind of sucks because as i was looking and it's actually interesting they actually detail what you unlock and show you what you get every single level all the way up to level 100 but starting off they do give you some wild frontier skins that you can use on rave on lifeline and on mirage as you guys can see these are these skins that you get they're pretty interesting. They're pretty cool in my opinion, but uh, they're also looking pretty basic. Like I feel like they're not like super crazy out there. So then if you go down, you can actually see the unlock for Octane as a character is actually all the way at tier 48 or level 48. So if you're someone who wants to unlock this guy as quick as possible, you're probably going to want to buy the 2800 Apex coin bundle and then buy more from there if you want. But I'm a little bit bummed out they have it all the way over here, but I guess the counter argument would be that not everyone is going to be trying to fight for octane at the same time so i guess it's kind of balanced i just wish it wasn't that far off but going through all the different tiers we obviously have the the first one which is the set of apex uh basically wild frontier skins or whatever we have some outfits here or or skins for some of the weapons uh, i think this might be the triple take i think this is the hemlock you get a counter for Ray for season one kills i still find this interesting kind of annoying that they have this behind a paywall like why are we paying to be able to show how many kills we got in season one? That's just me. All right, that's just me. I don't know what exactly this is, but it's just something five for level five. We have a little voice work here for uh, Bangalore at, at uh, tier six or level six. We've got some more icons here. Another outfit prowler right here. This is a, a skin for that. Uh, level 10. I don't know what that exactly is. Again, we got some XP. We got the season one kill counter for Octane. Uh, I forgot what this one was. Uh, this is a sniper though, For but we got a, another another camo for that guy. We go over to tier 15. We see we have a voice one for Mirage. We have the counter here for season one for Lifeline. The Spitfire uh, over here. We have a what looks like a pretty decent looking, kind of basic looking camo. We got some more XP up uh, until level 22. We have the season one kill counter for Bangalore at uh, tier 21. Then we have uh, a skin or camo for the mozambique i believe that's the mozambique but then we have uh, 25 we have i believe this is just a supply drop with some really cool stuff in it i'm really happy they're actually having like this legendary one here so maybe you can get something really good out of it uh, but yeah so then we have uh, some intro voiceover here for pathfinder season one kill counter for mirage as well we go on over to 29 through 36 we have one here for a sniper is that a new weapon i don't know i can't really tell uh, but then we have 30 markers some xp the kill counter for pathfinder we have the eva 8 uh camo over here we have the intro audio for caustic at 36 move on over to tiers 37 and we have one for the i believe this is the flat line here the kill counter for caustic 40 xp another one of these pecs packs uh little bots or whatever 
Uh, and then we have one of the uh, camos here for, I forgot the name of this SMG because I never use it. But for that SMG, <laughs> we have obviously Octane at tier 48, like I mentioned. We have a camo here for the Peacekeeper. This actually looks pretty interesting, looks pretty cool. Uh, and we have an intro audio here for, I'm blanking on the name. We have another intro audio here over here, blanking on the name of this ledge. I don't know, I never use them and I, I forgot his name. But anyway, so we go up to tier 50. We have another decal looking thing. We have a really cool camo for the Prowler over here at 51. We have another one of these Apex bots. I believe this is the Devotion LMG. Uh, this one has its own kind of camo. It looks kind of like the camo for the Peacekeeper actually. So it might be just the same camo over there. Then we have a intro audio for Mirage over here at 56. We have another camo here for another weapon. I don't know which one this one is. Uh, then we have the Octane Season 1 Kill Counter. We have a camo for the P2020 over here at 64. And uh, then we have another weapon over here. I believe this is the Havoc, actually. And then we have an intro audio for um, Bloodhound over here as well. Another counter, another little banner over here, some XP. So it looks like there's just a lot of banners and decals and stuff, which I'm a little bit disappointed in seeing. But uh, it is what it is. We have another Apex bot over here. We have one for the... I believe this is the R99 over here. We have the intro counter for Octane or intro audio for him, which is pretty interesting. The season one counter for Bangalore. We have the uh, camo for the wingman, which looks pretty dope. Uh, don't know what this is. I, again, I don't know what exactly these are. Are they just like decals that you can rock? I don't know. But then we have another banner, some more XP, another bot. We have one here for the pistol, the fully auto pistol. I'm blanking on the name. We have another gold bot. This one looks kind of different from the other one. So maybe this one is like a super ultra good one at tier 86. Go to 87 through 94. We have a lot of cosmetic stuff and then one camo for the G2, I believe, uh, and another bot. But everything else is just cosmetic stuff that you really can't do anything with in game. We have another intro audio for Lifeline. We have another camo. I believe this is the R301. And then this one looks like a really cool camo or kind of mastercraft on top that you use on the Havoc, which also looks pretty dope. So this is the tier 100 reward. So let me know what you guys think about all these rewards down in the comment section below, but it looks like they're going to have a lot of cosmetics on here. If I'm being completely honest with you guys, I'm actually a little bit disappointed because I feel like there just was a lot of just filler stuff like this or, you know, these little decals or banners. I, I Audio, I totally get. I think that's pretty cool. The actual camos are pretty cool. The fact that you get Octane is cool. But there's a lot of stuff that just, like, it feels like it's just filling up and not really doing anything. It's just, like, filler stuff. And that might, might, might just be me. Comment down below what you guys think of all 100 tiers. But uh, they also do have below that, actually, what you get as a free reward so everyone who plays apex legends season one can earn five apex packs eight shield 18 wild frontier stat trackers and one wild frontier legendary skin for octane so there we go 950 coins or 2800 if you get those then you get this battle pass and you get all of these rewards let me know what you guys think about them down in the comment section below if you guys enjoyed the video, do me a huge favor, guys. Drop a like and a favor on the video. It's super, super helpful. Appreciate it. And if you are new to the channel, if you want to see even more videos like these, I'm going to have a ton more Apex Legends, news info, rumors, leaks, and more coming. So make sure you guys are subscribed and have notifications on so you don't miss a single upload here on the channel. If you guys do want to support the channel directly, you guys can do so by checking out my channel memberships. You get access to early content, exclusive videos, special badges, and a whole bunch more. So go ahead, check those out only if you're willing and able to. And then if you want to talk about anything, Twitter is the best place to talk i am constantly talking over there so go ahead and give me a follow at ogx3 is linked down below you guys have an awesome awesome day take care i'm out peace